In this video, I'll show you how to replace the first n characters of a cell with something else in Microsoft Excel. Okay, so I have a data set over here, and the objective here is to replace the first three characters in each of these cells with something else. So in other words, I want to replace the EUR, which appears in the first three characters in each of these cells with something else. In this case, I want to replace them with USD. So that's what I want to do. And the traditional way of doing this is just doing a simple find and replace in Microsoft Excel. So just to select this range and then go to home and find and replace. Now the issue with this is if I use this approach, all instances of this text, EUR, will be replaced with the new text. But that's not what I want. I want only the first three characters to be replaced with something else. And to achieve that, I'm going to use a formula, which is currently displayed on the screen right here. This is the replace formula. And without any further ado, I'll apply it to this range right here. So here's how it goes. The first argument is the old text, that is the text or cell that needs replacement. The next argument will be the start number, that is the reference. Here, we have to indicate the starting point at which the text needs to be replaced with something else. In this place, the starting point or the starting number is one, since we want to start replacing at the first character. And the third argument is the number of characters to be replaced. So we want to replace three characters, in this case, the first three characters. So the reference being one, the third argument is going to be three, which indicates we want to replace the first three characters with something else. And the final argument is the new text, which will replace the old text, which in this case is EUR. And the new text in this scenario is USD, which needs to be inputted within double quotations. So I'll put double quotations, USD, closing double quotations, and then closing parentheses. Then I'll click on enter. And as you can see here, this formula has correctly replaced the first three characters of this cell with something else, in this case, USD. And now I'll apply it to the full range. And as you can see here, I was able to successfully replace the first three characters of all these cells with something else without replacing the similar three characters which appears at the end of each of these cells. And this is how it's done. I hope you've enjoyed this video and found it useful. If yes, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And also, if you like my content and you enjoy my videos, make sure you subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already, and also turn on notifications so you won't miss out on my future videos.